Oh, hello. We didn't see you there. We were just lost in a magical discussion about all the wonders of x-rays. You know, x-rays. You don't, don't know, know what x-rays are? X-rays are used every day by doctors to diagnose broken bones. They're also used by scientists to examine the structure of crystals or even watch an insect breathe. But what are x-rays? How are they created? What are they from? And what advancements are there? Well, we'll get to answering these questions, but for now, let's start at the beginning. So, Professor Röntgen, how did you stumble upon x-rays? Well, it all began in the late 1895. I was experimenting on passing an electric current through very little air inside a glass tube. This would create a glow at the ends of the tubes when the current was turned on. However, in one particular experiment, I decided to cover the tube with a thick black card. Consequently, the light from the glow was trapped inside. Now, when I turned the current on, I noticed in the corners of my eye that a nearby screen coated with barium platinocyanide had begun to glow. At first, I was not quite sure that it was my machine that was causing this. But after a few further tests and checks, I realized that it was definitely my machine that was responsible for the glow. I was greatly disturbed by this, freaked out, you may say. I had to know how it all worked. So I spent the next few weeks just in the lab. I spent so much time there, <laughs> I even slept there on occasion. But it was not enough. After a while, I grew anxious to test my new race, which I had named X-rays. I decided to take an X-ray image of my beautiful wife Anna's hand. She was, to say the truth, quite reluctant at first, but I am a very persuasive man. Here you see the X-ray. Look, you see the wedding ring on her finger, and even, look closely, even the bones themselves. And the rest, as they say, is history. I was awarded a Nobel Prize for my discovery, which was in fact the first awarded in the area of physics. I realize now that it was on that day that I had a date, and a date with destiny. Medical imaging isn't the only use for x-rays. People use x-rays in airport security, unraveling the structure of DNA, finding small cracks in metal, and heaps more. Hey, Oregon. Hey, Drunken. What would you see if you did an x-ray on our brains? Absolutely nothing. <laughs> <laughs>